We're harvesting cash this fall on 95.9 The River. Hey, here's a guy who can help harvest your cash. Let's welcome Ray Cruz, our financial guru. Cruz yeah. Investments and Wealth Management. How you doing, brother? I'm doing fantastic. How are you, boys? Uh, happy Friday. I am doing well. Jan, how are you? I am fantastic. Man, it's a feel-good Friday, and we got Ray Cruz here. Come on, man. Uh, I know. It's very good. Uh, you know, but the economy's not too good. If inflation's still not under control. we got a lot of issues out there, don't we, Ray? We do, Scott. You know, the markets are still going a little crazy. Inflation is not under control. The markets are just really, really jittery with almost any economic data that's coming out right now. Lots of risks in the market still. Inflation not under control. What should people be doing right now, Ray? Yeah, Scott, and it's really crazy because we've got a bad inflation number yesterday in the market. It's a bad number, okay? And, and and the market went up 600 points. Right. So I mean, usually when you get bad news, the market goes down. Yesterday it went up. So, But I think what's happening out there and what people need to be doing is, is what we've been talking about literally for over three years as we've been on the air with you guys. You need to make sure that you're protecting your principal. You need to make sure that you're doing some really good planning because these are tough times and we still have some tough times that may come ahead. And you need to have that written retirement income plan. You need to know where your money is coming from every single month so you can hit all of your expenses, so you can go on vacation, so you can have birthdays, so you can have Christmas, right, that's coming up. And you can still live a good retirement, right, during these economic difficult times. Well, sure you can. And I know we'll delve in into this topic a little bit deeper on Sunday. I want to remind people Ray Cruz and Cruising into Retirement is now on Sundays and it starts at 8.15 a.m. But, I mean, we go, we deep dive into this. Well, yeah. he does. I just listen and learn. And that's good. But how long do you think, Ray, is this economic environment going to last? Wow, that's the uh, million dollar question, right, Scott? So based on economics right now, the White House has, you know, their economic plan. The Fed is trying to fight inflation. So they keep raising the interest rates based on some of the experts that I've talked to. And nobody knows this, Scott. OK, you can't take anything that any financial professional says, you know, as knowing because nobody really knows. But people are talking about that this is going to last for a while as long as the Fed sees inflation. They're going to continue to raise rates up. And what I'm hearing from experts that we watch, that we read, that we listen to, it's going to last probably at least until February or March until inflation gets under control. So we've got, you know, another six months or so where we might see, again, a lot of volatility with the markets and inflation continuing to go up. But just nobody really knows, Scott. Yeah. Well, 7.1 percent interest rate now. And I guess the Fed, uh, they're going to raise it one more time <laughs> at least. <laughs> well, that, that, based on the numbers that they see and they look at and when they meet, they always determine that and close rooms and then they bring it out and give it to the media and you know, things happen. Yeah. So what happens, though, um, Ray, if inflation continues during your retirement and then the market continues to go down? Yeah, that's kind of a double edged uh, sword that hits you from multiple uh, directions, Scott. So, you know, if inflation goes up, right, so that that uh, uh, when you go to fill up your gas, I used to fill up my car for twenty six dollars. Mm -hmm. Right now it's costing me like forty six dollars to fill up. So now I'm losing $20 a week just on gas. But that's really affecting you with food, and that's affecting you with everything else that you're purchasing. So you can't purchase as many things. So if inflation continues, all of a sudden your spending power is less than what it was before. And if you have money in the markets and the markets continue to go down and you lose another 10% on your portfolio, now you don't have that money generating more money to help you during this inflationary time yeah. so again you got to protect you got to plan and you got to know where your retirement income is coming from you got to have a written plan for that scott i think some of the first uh, words out of your mouth when i met you uh, over three years ago was the written retirement income plan which you put Susie, uh, my wife and myself through so i understand why it's so important it's really the start of all of it yeah absolutely scott and today here's what we're going to do for the first six callers for six callers for the first six people that text us who've saved at least $250,000 or more for retirement, again, the first six people that text us the word book, 
to 630-897-4233. Again, 630-897-4233. Text us the word book. As long as you've, as long as you've saved $250,000 or more for retirement, we're going to send you out complimentary, no obligation, a copy of our book, Retire Abundantly. Hey, uh, Jan, can you sing them out? Accounts payable, accounts receivable. He's the man with the do's and don'ts. Ray hey, Cruz. Okay. Very good, Jeff. I'm impressed. <laughs> Ray. Remember, guys, I don't do jingles, and I'm not just eye candy. <laughs> I know stuff. Thanks, Ray. We'll see you on Sunday. All right, buddy. Oh, I love Ray Cruz.